January 8th, 1861, two days before Florida's succession, Confederate sympathizers, the 3rd Regiment of Florida Volunteers, took control of Fort Clinch, already abandoned by the federal workers who had been enlarging the structure. Confederate Army erected batteries on the northern end of Amelia Island, but lacked the resources to fortify Fort Clinch. Robert E. Lee, who was commanding coastal defenses in the Deep South, ordered cannons and troops withdrawn in early 1862. General Lee's orders to withdraw the cannons and troops were too late. Union forces, consisting of 28 gunboats, commanded by Commander Samuel Dupont, occupied the island on March 3, 1862, and raised the eighth and final flag over Fernadina, the American flag. In January 1863, the first all-black regiment of former slaves recruited to fight for the Union was read Lincoln's Emancipation Proclamation at Fernandina. Three weeks later, the regiment set sail up the St. Mary's River to engage the Confederate forces. The Union used the fort 
as a base for its operations in the area for the remainder of the Civil War.